Hello everyone and welcome back. Today I wanted to uh, show you something that I recently picked up just a few days ago and it's uh, Stanley headphones, hearing protection basically and with a built-in AM FM radio. Um, the reason why I purchased these is because well like many people uh, when you're interested in protecting your ears from, uh, from damage, you know, from hearing loss. And uh, being a musician, of course, I, I really do take extra care uh, in trying to protect my hearing, among all my other faculties. But uh, hearing is very important, of course, to a musician. So um, I've been u using uh, protective hearing devices uh, for many, many years. And I picked these up specifically for when I'm using the lawnmower. Uh, snowblower, chainsaw, uh, basically those three items. There could be other things I could be using that uh, may warrant me to have your hearing protection, but that's what I'll be using them for. But the reason why I bought these is because of the AM FM radio. Um, actually, the AM FM radio on this is, has awesome reception and good quality of sound. Uh, my nephew, Matthew, purchased a set a few years ago and he told me, he said, they were absolutely wicked so I purchased them and now I have uh, the Stanley headphones now here is the box that they came in that I got so aggressive in uh, opening them and uh, wanting to try them out that I neglected to do a, an opening there's some of the information you can pause the camera if you'd like to get some of that information excuse the, the camera that I'm using here um, it's a webcam and it's kind of doing a, a focus thing there anyway see the noise reduction rating of 25 a couple of things I want to mention about these headphones um, <clears throat> you see the, the battery compartment here on the side uh, this battery on the left goes positive up and negative down one issue with this uh, headphone jack uh, battery cover, battery cover I should say, is uh, it's not so easily installed. Now it may go on perfectly, but you may see these ears here on this side and that side. They have to lock into these grooves here. You can see that groove right there. And uh, it's kind of cumbersome to get the battery door on. Now it went down perfectly that time because I, I realized that you got to kind of squeeze down on this edge here. And for getting it off, to remove it, you push this and then push forward. So I'll see if I can push in on that. There we go. Now I've noticed online that some, a couple of places that complain that this here actually breaks something that's broken now it's pretty flexible plastic but I can imagine after a while probably out in the sun and eventually it would probably dry out and with you know the sun's UV rays and stuff like that would probably make this more sensitive to a uh, breakage and I actually ran across a second hand set of these that were for sale and they were asking a fair dollar for it and the battery compartment the battery door I should say to the battery compartment was missing so Anyway, we're going to try to install this once again. So I would caution you. Yeah, that time I think it went down good. Yeah, I would caution you about that. That's the only flaw I would say with this uh, head, head protection radio system. It's got a rubber uh, gooseneck there, a, a rubber antenna, whatever you want to call it. Now, uh, to power on, oh, before I go, further in uh, this discussion this is the volume button and these are your controls the radio itself doesn't get very loud and there's a reason for that remember these are hearing protective headphones so they obviously got to follow strict regulations as to how loud the radio gets in these speakers because uh, what's the sense to try to protect your ears if this is going to be booming loud and the music you're listening to is going to be doing hearing damage so 
there's a specific limit to the volume but it's plenty of volume to be listening while you're mowing the lawn using the snowblower chainsaw using any kind of power tools or in a construction area I would say that these probably would be illegal or immoral to use in a construction area because um, even though they do blank out noise uh, you in the construction uh, situation and environment uh, you would probably want to have some hearing even though this is muffing your the muffing the sound you wouldn't want the radio playing so you'd be totally distracted in case somebody was trying to call out to you or something was you know a piece of equipment was backing up or something so I'd say for personal use to exactly what these are used for but in the construction industry, uh, industry I would say this is a no-no. They power up here you basically press and hold so it was not just a press button because it would be accidentally pressed so you press and hold and it turns on and I think if I press just uh, quickly that brings me to the AM and FM. It's on AM now and bring it to the FM I think yep and uh, you can go through the channels to, you can program your channels in and you can go step by step through all the programs. The only thing I noticed is that in order to go to the AM presets you have to go back to AM to get your presets which are stored on one of the ten channels from zero to nine it goes to. The programming is a little bit difficult um, but once you catch on to it there's no problem. You basically tune in your radio either as AM or FM you tune in the radio station by pressing this button, pressing and holding, and it'll scan your, your frequencies, of course. And once you find a channel that you want, you press memory. P sorry, press and hold. Let me see if I can do this again. Okay, we'll do this 95.9. Press and hold. And when this blinks, you can select what channel you want it under. Hope you're seeing all this. And I'm going to put this under, I think it's under one. Once you uh, see one here blinking, select again. And it's locked in. So that's pretty well all I want to do uh, with regard to showing you the new protective hearing headphones I have. And um, I can certainly attest that the sound quality, although not extremely loud, is not going to hurt your ears. Uh, it's going to be, you're going to be pleasantly surprised at how good this sounds and another reason why I purchased this before I go my uh, nephew Matthew he works uh, part somebody's work entails going into uh, the woods in the forest basically he's a guide and uh, he goes into a camp which is a long ways in in the country uh, guiding for you know like uh, well caribou moose bear whatever has been licensed uh, could even be just as much as uh, going in for trout or salmon, whatever, whatever it is that uh, that's on the go. And he's a long ways from the radio stations. I mean, a long ways. You know, in places where probably you'd be very lucky to get a radio station. Now, in the camp, um, they have what they do. They go up on the mountain in order if they want to, re you know, to to transmit a, a signal out. Uh, by cell phone but they do have satellite radios in there so you know in case of an emergency but uh, he can listen to radio stations down along the lake with this here AM and FM all pretty well all the frequencies he tells me in this area that we get in our area he can get out there and there's no other radio in the camp anything that they have found so far that could do it but this does this manages to do it so that's the bulk of the reason probably also why I purchased the the, the radio because it's uh, uh, because it's sensitivity and uh, quality anyway that's it that is the max safety sync radio by the way there's a cord that came with it just a standard cord 3.5 inch jack and that basically lets you tap in through here uh, your mp3 player iPhone uh, Android whatever you want to type tap into there um, any any phone and of course uh, I mentioned the volume button and all that so that's it um, it's uh, basically what they call the sync max safety sync radio and uh, hearing protector with digital AM FM radio and mp3 connection
hope you enjoyed the video folks uh, trying out a new camera well, not a new camera not even new to me but just a new idea with this uh, webcam uh, hopefully the focus never went too crazy thank you enjoy please rate and subscribe